as compared to big box because there are so many ins and outs of the doors in residential assisted living it's only one entrance to the home so i really like that and personalized care we talked about that you know the ratio is very low one to four or one to five there are two caregivers like for 10 residents in my communities like during the day and one a caregiver at night time so that you know they could do when the seniors need 24-hour care most of the seniors are sleeping at night time but if they need help you know and so on so let's talk about this here this is a very important slide see stable and reliable cash flows huge 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 if your home if it's five bedroom you could do sharing of the bedrooms and all if there are set 10 10 seniors that can be housed of course each state has a different law like in california in one single family home only six seniors can live in that home in texas i was told like 16 i don't own anything there yet in florida also i heard that it's six but in arizona it's 10 in one single family home so if there are 10 seniors in a single family home and they each pay about 5000 to 6000 a piece there is a revenue monthly revenue of 50 to 60000 coming into this single family home assisted living